Hello guys and welcome to my YouTube channel for baking and tutorials. If you haven't checked the previous Christmas recipes, you can check it out now. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make mini Christmas pod muffins. In this sieve, you'll see the cocoa powder, which is 25 grams, and also to this, I'm going to add the castor sugar, which is 75 grams. as well as the 100 grams of plain flour and half a teaspoon of bicarb or soda and finally one teaspoon of baking powder so give these these dry ingredients a sift like this As you can see, I could see the lumps in the sieve. If you have lumps, give them a scrape in the sieve so there's no visible lumps of cocoa or sugar anywhere. Next part is I'm going to stir in the raisins stir in 20, 25 grams of raisins and then put half the an ounce of chocolate chips in there and just give it a stir Next is going to add in one egg and also to the egg is 100 millilitres of milk and finally three tablespoons of vegetable oil Next thing we're going to do is to mix the milk, the oil and the egg with a fork.
So after the wet ingredients has been mixed in with the fork, you can put it in along with the dry ingredients. And just put it in and mix it into it as a runny batter. Once it's formed to a runny batter, I'm going to transfer it into a jar. It, this, it, this looks like a run, liquidy batter and has a chocolate smell. Now I've got the cupcake ices. Now you can put this in for 24 muffins, standard wise. Could you see that I've done the first row? Do the same with the rest of the cupcake ices. Once the cupcake batter has been filled, you're going to scatter them with the remaining chocolate chips. Now the chocolate chips have been scattered on top of the chocolate batter, muffin batter. Now you're going to put this in the oven for 15 minutes. Now I've preheated the oven for 200 degrees A, 15 minutes until you stick a skewer inserted into these muffins or until risen in front of a torch. Now pause the video now, I'm going to show you what to do next after it's been baked. Okay. Once the muffins has been baked and done in the oven, we're just going to measure out 75 grams of white chocolate.
I weighed it 75 grams and it says 78. Does it matter to you? Now for this, you're going to have to melt the white chocolate in a bowl place over a pan of hot water. In case you didn't know what the melted white chocolate was for, it's for the topping of the chocolate Christmas pub muffins. As you can hear this, it rem it resembles the simmering of the water from the pan. As you can see, the chocolate pieces have already been melted. So give this a chance to actually let the white chocolate completely melt from the simmering water. I have melted the hot chocolate and I put it on the top of the muffins. Then you gotta decorate it with the Christmas pudding topping. Now do the same for the rest of the muffins. These are the cupcakes that are already done and sprinkled with olives on it and looks like a Christmas pod muffins. So if you like this video, don't forget to put a like on the button and subscribe so you don't miss any baking tutorials. Bye and comment what your suggestions are. Next. Tutorial.